our Chief Justice and our Honorable Governor. Asante ni pia kwa zile nderemu. Uh, we recognize that this county has produced a considerable number of our judges, past and present, and also prominent lawyers in the history of this country. Therefore, I have no hesitation to accept the request that this court be named Awis Kothek CIA High Court. And we will move towards gazetting that in honor of one of the very first indigenous lawyers of this country. It is befitting to be named at this event where we are talking about deepening access to justice in a county whose sons and daughters are playing a very, very significant role in the development of our legal system. Today, we make a significant stride in addressing one of our most daunting challenges by launching the sexual and gender-based violence. We designate the CIA Sexual and Gender-Based Violence Court, the second one after the one we launched in Mombasa last year, as a clear demonstration of our unwavering commitment to eradicate atrocities from our society. We must never, never look back to a situation where the gains we have made under this constitutional dispensation to be clawed back. I don't want to take for granted ever in my life the importance of an independent judiciary. And I've lived to it to see the difference between an independent judiciary uh, and a judiciary. Uh, an executive control judiciary. So uh, in your able hands, and uh, those of your colleagues in the judiciary, whether you make decisions that we like or we don't like, the most important thing is we should never, never, never lose that battle again where we have to fight for a free and independent judici judiciary. Because it cost a lot of lives, uh, a lot of people suffered for it, and if we fail as a nation not to have a free and independent judiciary, all else will be impossible to achieve.